Welcome to our channel. In this video, we are going to talk about foods that prevent and cure cancer. So before starting, please like this video and subscribe to our channel for future updates. Many people are curious whether certain dietary choices can help prevent or reduce the progression of cancer. An excellent place to start is by eating a wide variety of plant foods. Hundreds of health-promoting phytochemicals are found in fruits, vegetables, grains, and legumes that you wouldn't find in a nutritional supplement. Here are some of the most effective cancer-fighting foods to include on your menu. Number 6. Broccoli Sulforaphane, a plant chemical present in cruciferous vegetables, may have significant anti-cancer activities that are found in broccoli. Sulforaphane was found to lower the size and number of breast cancer cells by up to 75% in test tube research. In a similar animal study, sulforaphane was found to help kill prostate cancer cells and shriek tumor volume by more than half in mice. A higher diet in cruciferous vegetables, like broccoli, has been associated with a lower risk of colorectal cancer in several studies. Consuming more cruciferous vegetables was linked to a lower risk of colorectal and colon cancer according to a review of 35 researches. Including broccoli and a couple of meals a week may have a chance of fighting cancer fighting properties. Keep in mind though that the available study hasn't specifically looked at how broccoli may cause cancer in humans. Instead, it's been restricted to test tube, animal, and observational research that looked at the effective of cruciferous vegetables or a specific component in broccoli. As a result, more research is required. Number 5. Carrots Several studies have identified a correlation between eating more carrots and a lower risk of some cancers. An analysis of the results of five researches, for example, found that consuming carrots may cut the incident of stomach cancers by up to 26%. Another study discovered that eating more carrots was linked to 18% lower risk of prostate cancer. One study looked at the diets of 1,266 people who had lung cancer and those who didn't. Current smokers who did not consume carrots were three times more likely to acquire lung cancer than those who ate carrots more than once a week, according to the study. To improve your intake and maybe lessen your cancer risk, try introducing carrots into your diet as a nutritional snack or delectable side dish for a few times per week. However, keep in mind that while these studies suggest a link between carrot consumption and cancer, they don't take into other factors into account. Number 4. Beans Beans are abundant in fiber, which has been linked to reduce the risk of colon cancer in several studies. One study examined 1,905 people who had previously had colon cancer and discovered that those who ate more cooked, dried beans had a lower chance of recurrence. A study on rats discovered that feeding them black beans or navy beans, then generating colon cancer stopped cancer cells from growing by up to 75%. According to these findings, eating a few servings of beans each week will help you get even more fiber and reduce your risk of cancer. The existing data, however, is restricted to animal studies and trials that demonstrate connection but not causality. More research into this, specifically in people, is required. Number 3. Berries Berries are high in anthracycins, which are plant pigments with antioxidant characteristics and may be linked to lowering cancer risk. In one human trial, 25 people with colon cancer were given Bibliary extract for 7 days and discovered that it reduced cancer cells growth by 7%. Another small trial found that giving freeze-dried black raspberries to patients with oral cancer reduced the levels of some cancer-related indicators. Giving rats freeze-dried black raspberries lowered the incidence of esophageal tumors by up to 54% and the number of tumors by up to 62% according to one animal study. Similarly, rats given berry extract were found to be blocked by more cancer indicators than another animal investigation. According to these findings, having a serving or two of berries in your daily diet may help to prevent cancer from developing. Keep in mind that these are animal and observational studies examining the effects of concentrated dose of a berry extract. Further human research is required. Number 2. Nuts Nut consumption has been related to a lower risk of certain cancers according to research. For example, one study looked at the diets of 19,386 people and discovered that consuming more nuts was linked to a lower risk of cancer death. Another study monitored 30,708 people, 
for up to 30 years and discovered that consistently consuming nuts was linked to a lower risk of colorectal, pancreatic, and endometrial malignancies. Other research has connected to specific types of nuts to reduced risk of cancer. Brazil nuts, for example, are high in selenium, which may help prevent people with lower selenium levels from lung cancer. Similarly, feeding mice walnuts lowered the development rate of breast cancer cells by 80%, and a number of tumors by 60%, according to one animal study. These findings imply that including serving nuts in your daily diet may lower your risk of cancer in the future. More human research is needed to determine if nuts are the cause of this link or if other factors are in play. And number one, whole grains. Hundreds of compounds in whole grains have health-promoting properties. For instance, the fiber in whole grains may help prevent colorectal cancer. Their saponins and phenols may lower the risk of colon and breast cancer. These dietary choices offer the best protection when combined with regular exercise, maintaining a healthy weight, a smoke-free lifestyle, and participating in recommended cancer screenings. That was the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed that. Leave a like and comment to show you your love and support. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and press the icon for the notification of our latest videos. Thanks for watching, and remember, keep your inner genius alive.